you can switch project inside Smoke without having to exit the application. Click the Preferences button on the Edit Desk. Under the Project Management section, choose the project you want to access. Then, press Load to load it. I have chosen the Tutorials project. You can exit the Preferences and have a look at the Edit Desk and also at the libraries that belong to that project. You can modify some of the parameters of an existing project. Go back in the Preferences menu. Press the Edit Project button. Here I want to change the proxy option. I'm going to turn them on and keep the default size at 50%. Be aware that this will take some storage space and also it will take time to generate the proxies. This process cannot be aborted. Press Apply Changes and Confirm. If you have footage inside your project, the proxies will be generated and you have to wait that the process is completed. The proxies are useful to increase the interactivity. Exit the Preferences to go back to the Edit Desk. Hold down Alt and click on the source clip to display its information. Notice that it displays the full resolution and the proxy size. You can switch between full resolution and proxies inside the player and as well inside the modules. Choose the standard player in the source area layout. You can switch between the full resolution and the proxy resolution whenever needed. You can also use the proxies inside the modules. For example, I am accessing the Action module. The option to switch between full res and proxy is under the Setup Preferences tab. The orange outline in the view indicates that you are in proxy mode. Now let's have a look at the user. Go back to the Edit Desk and in the Preferences menu. Press the Edit User button. You could change the user hotkey profile inside that menu. Press Apply Changes and Confirm. The Smoke Preferences are saved with your user. All these settings are saved with the current user. For example, if I deactivate the tooltips, this will stay with my current user. As well, the hotkeys are saved with the user. Open the Hotkey Editor. It displays the hotkeys that are related to the current module. Now exit the Hotkey Editor. Go to the Edit Desk. Press Ctrl-Alt-F8 to open the hotkey editor from any module. The white hotkeys are general. The yellow ones are specific to the current module. In this case, the Edit Desk. You can search hotkeys. You can also customize hotkeys and save them with your user. In the next exercise, you will see how to import and organize footage inside Smoke.